Okay guys, so for dinner today, we're gonna cook or rather steam some fish and veggies in parchment paper. So to get started, I'm just gonna cut up the, the veggies that I have available. So I'm gonna be using carrots, some tomatoes, two types of celery. So we have the celery stalk and celery with the leaves. And we're also gonna put some side on top. We're also gonna use some lime juice. We're gonna use some dill. We're also gonna use some of this herbal seasoning blend. This does not have any salt in it. And we're also gonna use some sea salt and also some of our brown sauce that we made that is soy and gluten free all right so let's get cutting up the vegetables i'm going to put the vegetables in this bowl and season it up first Okay, so now we're gonna season up our veggies. We're gonna put some olive oil on it. Okay, so let's, we're gonna add some salt to our veggies, sea salt. We will also add some dill it we we'll add some of our herbal blend to it and let's also add some white pepper as well pepper all right so our veggies are it's all seasoned up now we're going to work on our fish so to do the fish you're going to get a sheet of our parchment paper as you can see here and we're going to fold it we're going to fold it before we do that let's put some oil in the parchment paper we'll put some olive oil We're just going to wipe it. Okay. Now we're going to fold it in half and make a crease. in half and we make a crease and we're going to open it back up so we're going to put a bed of our veggies here so we have a bed of our veggies like that and then we're going to place our fish on top our bed of veggies To the fish, we're going to add a little sprinkling of sea salt. We're going to add some of the dill. We're going to add some of our herbal blend. We're going to add a little bit of white pepper we are also going to squeeze some lime juice over it so I'm using half of a lime squeezing it over it and I'm also 
going to put some of my brown sauce, Let's maybe pour it into the spoon, some of the brown sauce over it as well. All right, now we close this up. So we bring the other side of the parchment paper over. And what we're going to do, let me bring this into frame so you can see. Okay, so to seal it, we're just going to fold in the sides. So we make a fold, we press down. We overlap in the folds. Make a fold, we press down. Make a fold, we press down. You can see what I'm doing, I'm overlapping the folds. And this is how we want to seal in the veggies and the fish. And just keep on folding and pressing down. Fold and we press in like that. So now we have sealed the fish and the veggies in here. And we're just going to put this on our baking sheet, which is here. And we're going to put it in the oven to bake. We're going to bake it at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. Of course, our oven is preheating already. So let me do the rest, and then we'll get it into the oven. Guys, sorry for the noise in the background, but that's my ice cream maker. But if you could only smell this, oh my goodness, it smells so good. There you have it, your fish baked with steam in parchment paper.